That would really be a game changer. How soon are we expecting this and is this even feasible? Well, nobody's really sure yet. CATL just announced these new batteries yesterday, and we're still waiting for a lot of details to come out. Uh, but what they're saying basically is that through a, a mix of different new materials, they can you know, sort of create these microscopic chemical nets within the batteries that can let lithium ions shoot back and forth faster without compromising safety. And, and that allows them to load more energy uh, into a smaller package, which is really important for something like an airplane where we're uh, weight is really uh, a key factor. Um, now, CATL said that they sh will be able to start mass producing batteries using this technology this year, but at a, a sort of lower level for, for EVs. Um, they're still working with, uh, with companies right now to develop this electric aircraft. There's no timetable. They, they're not saying uh, yet who they're working with on it. Um, but you know, the, the fact that they, uh, they wanted to make a big splashy announcement at the Shanghai Auto Show has, uh, has analysts saying that you know, it's a pretty positive sign that they, uh, they have a lot of faith in this technology. What kind of other applications are we expecting that this could be used in? Well, that, that's one of the big questions we have. You know, obviously, if you uh, produce an EV that, or a battery that's strong enough to, to lift an airplane off the ground, that could make market improvements <laughs> in ranges for electric cars. But one of the other things we don't know about is cost. And right now, you know, EVs are, are getting pretty good mileage. You know, at the auto show earlier this week, an SUV announced it can get up to a thousand kilometers on uh, on existing batteries. Uh, and so, depending on how much this costs, it, it's unclear whether it'll actually be able to break through into the EV industry in a, in a real way, or if it's just going to be kind of a niche product until you know, the, uh, the electric aircraft business can sort of gain steam.